Hi everyone, this is Miriam. Yes, I know I'm a little bit early this week on a Monday rather than Tuesday or Wednesday, but I have a reason for this. Um, I wanted to talk about something wonderful that would be great to start the week with. And also because this is a very exciting week, one way or another, so I figured let's just start it on a really positive note. Today I am talking about joy. Now, yes, it's very general as a concept, joy. Take your pick with descriptions. However, what I'm talking about today is basically joy jar. Yeah, that sounds funny. <laughs> I know, I know, but bear with me here. The idea of joy jar is that every single day, you know, before this, this would be best if you do this before you go to bed or sometime in the evening when your day is pretty much over to have a jar or a bowl or a container, a box, if you will. In my case, it's a journal that you can put anything that was joyful for you that day in there. Just write it on a little piece of paper, a little sticky or post it or whatever. Just put it on there and drop it in. It doesn't have to be anything outrageous. You know, it could be a wonderful cup of coffee you enjoyed. It could be, you know, you saw a little bird and heard it chirping and just really put a smile on your face. Maybe you smelled something and it was just wonderful or somebody smiled at you that made you happy. You know, anything, anything. It could be just the smallest little thing. Maybe you just saw this beautiful tree or beautiful leaf that was different colors all at once. Anything can bring you joy when you give it a chance. So think about what brings you. You know, you can also jot it down during the day. You know, if you do pass by this tree that just totally made you joyful, jot it down, make a little note of it. And then before you go to bed or before you retire for the evening, just take that piece of paper, drop it in. And then you can, let's say you do this for a week. I'm asking you to do this no, no shorter than a week, just to give it a real chance. And then at the end of the week, you look at everything that had brought you joy. Nothing other than joyful things, okay? This is the whole point of this exercise. Believe me, when you look back at all of this stuff, you're gonna experience all of that over again and will lift you up. The point of this is to raise the vibrations, raise your energy and begin everything positively. And when you go to bed on a positive note, everything will be more pleasant. Isn't that a fact? So this is it. This is it for this week. This is your whole assignment. When you do end up inspecting all your joyful moments, drop me a note and let me know how it was for you. I um, do it for a little bit longer, but you know, you can pick however interval of time you want to have. A week, no, no less than a week, okay? So here's to being joyful. Have a wonderful week and have a wonderful day.